Hey everybody, Katie here with Factory Direct Craft, and today I'm going to show you how to make this mini macrame wall hanging. All you need for this project is a dowel, some macrame cord, and a pair of scissors. So once you've grabbed your materials, let's go ahead and get started. So today we're making a hanging macrame. Um, we have separate videos showing you how to do each of these knots if you want a closer look um, at how to do the steps. Um, but this is going to be more of a broad overview on a full hanging macrame. Um, so once you've got your materials, let's get started. The first step is cutting your cord. So I'm going to do, um, we're going to do like a mini hanging macrame today. I have this little dowel. So I'm going to cut my cords about four and a half, five feet long. Just like so. And I'm gonna go ahead and cut a bunch of them um, and we're gonna fill up our whole dowel. Just make sure they are the same length. Okay, so I have six pieces cut so far. I may need to cut a few more, but this will give us a good start. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull your piece so that both of the ends are touching and you have a loop at the top. You're gonna lay your loop underneath the dowel, just like this. And I'm gonna take my two ends and put them through the loop. So over the dowel and under through the loop. And we're just gonna pull that tight. I'm gonna repeat this step with all of my pieces of macrame. Again, it's just meeting the ends. So you form a loop at the top. Lay the dowel over the loop. Take your ends over the dowel and down through the loop. And I'm just gonna add a seventh piece. Um, you can make your macrame as short or as long as you want all the way to the ends. Um, this is enough to show the steps and then we'll just have that cute mini macrame hanging in the middle. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and flip it over just so that these knots are facing this way. This doesn't matter, it's just preference. Um, I just like the way that this looks, I think it's nice and clean. And now we're going to go ahead and get started with our basic knot. Now there are, sometimes you can make a macrame with a pattern. Um, I prefer to just make a macrame and uh, there are three basic knots and you just tie them as you will and kind of see what comes. So that's what we're going to be doing today. So once your macrame setup is prepped, we're going to go ahead and start with the square knot. So this is really simple. All you're going to do is take your left cord. Um, you'll need the two sets of macrame cord for this. You take your left cord, put it over the two in the center under the fourth one, just like this. And so it's gonna look like a number four. And then you take this cord that's on top and bring it up and under and through the center of the four. Now this is half of your square knot. For the other half, you're gonna take this cord and make a four this way, over the two in the center and under the last one. And then you're gonna bring this tail up and under all of them through the center of the four. And we're gonna slide those up and pull them nice and tight. Just like that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and repeat um, my square knot until it's gone down about two or three inches. And there's our square knot. So next I'm going to do a twist, which is going to take these two center pieces. And it's essentially the same as our square knot, but it's gonna give us a rotation to it, which is just kind of a fun um, middle piece to your macrame art. So what you're gonna do for this is you're gonna make the number four, just like you did over the center two, under the left one, under the far right one. Take the right tail and slide it up through the center of the four. And now instead of repeating that step the opposite way, 
we're going to do it on the exact same side. So the four is on this side again, and the third chord over and up through the center. And you just keep repeating it with the four on this side, and it's going to give us a nice twist. So I'm going to do this until um, these knots reach the same length as my square knot on the side. So the final macrame knot we're going to be doing on this macrame piece is the half hitch. So with our final three that we have here, we're going to go ahead and take the far left cord and stretch it across in a diagonal pattern. Now you can do it straight across, you can do it diagonal, um, it's really up to you. I like it diagonal, I think it's a little more interesting. So once you've got that ready, you're going to go ahead and take your um, cord to the far left, make a U that goes over your diagonal cord and down through the center and pull that nice and tight. So again a U that goes over your diagonal and down through the center and we're pulling that nice and tight. Now it's important to keep your diagonal consistent as you go along your, your line of strings um, because this is the way that the knots are going to form. And you do every string in that U shape twice. Okay, and now that we've got our three basic knots all on our macrame hanging, it's time to start combining the tails so they go together. So I'm gonna start by combining these four pieces right here. And I'm just going to do a regular square knot. It helps you can just pull the other ones out of the way. So I'm going to do a four, Once you've got your three basic knots down, it really is easy to um, create your macrame wall art. So now you just um, play with different combinations of the knots until you have a piece that you love. So guys, I hope you have a lot of fun with this project. I'll show you my finished macrame piece when it's done. Thanks for watching. So now that my macrame, macrame weaving is done, I'm gonna go ahead and trim off the ends so they're all the same length. So I'm just gonna... And you can just pull them down so they hang as straight for you as they will. Now to display your macrame, just take some macrame cord. And we're gonna tie it off on either end of our dowel. and your macrame is ready to be displayed. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you have a lot of fun with this project.